Hi everyone, it's Jamel. Welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a while, but there's been a lot going on with our family. And so um, I just wanted to hop on here very quickly and just catch you up with what's going on with Sienna as we follow her through um, this process before we take her to get her um, autism diagnosis. So welcome back. Again, like I said, we've had a lot going on. Um, we've been pretty busy trying to like schedule her therapies and everything. Um, <clears throat> she was doing uh, speech therapy three days a week and then we had someone come into the house once a week to work with her, but now we're changing it up. We had someone um, with ABA therapy come in and do an assessment with her or we took her to the center to do an assessment. And so um, the ABA therapy is a little bit more intense and we're gonna switch up and, and go with the ABA therapy and then and still have someone come to the house once a week. So she'll be doing ABA therapy starting this week, um, twice a week, and then we'll still have someone come to the house and then she'll do daycare the rest of the days. So, um, but other than that, uh, she, she has, uh, we, we see a little bit of her um, doing new things here and there. Um, you know, the, we hear a lot more, ba not babbling, but more like vowel sounds. And uh, she's not saying words, or if she does say a word like a mama, dada, or we are practicing with eat. She is getting better with eat, and she can correlate eat with being hungry. So that one... Um, we have been working with but some of the other words it's just um, she doesn't correlate like mama with me or dada with my husband but other than that we've seen um, her do like a lot of new things which has been really uh, you know cool to see as, as she you know she's almost two years old so we uh, continue to be very intentional just with practicing um, with her at home and saying words loudly and um, what she's doing and just um, practicing a lot with her um, you know she uh, continues to just want to run around the house she loves her bubbles that's that's a big thing and the other thing that we've been practicing I don't know if I mentioned this in the last video but uh, practicing having her respond to her name so we've been taking blueberries we know blueberries is her favorite and so we take the blueberry and I don't put it to my eyes, but I hold it where she sees it and I continue to repeat and call her name and call her name until she actually makes eye contact with me. Sienna. 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 Hi, good morning. Good morning. Good job, baby. Good job. Sienna. Sienna, say hi, hello, good morning, good job, Sienna. So that has been, um, at first it took a while before she got it, but now she knows, like, if I'm holding a blueberry and I start calling her name, she starts looking at me. <clears throat> and the idea <clears throat> is that once uh, I call, continue to call her name and call her name, that she'll get used to me calling her name without me having a blueberry in my hand. And so, um, so yeah, that's been, that's been cool to, to see her getting better at that. Um, and then there's, there's this game that I think I showed in the last video where she really, she needed kind of her way of asking me for help was grabbing my hand to point to the item. Now she just kind of clicks. She's been, she's been, um, doing a lot better at pointing. <clears throat> So now she just kind of clicks the items to until she gets the right one. So uh, she really likes um, that app on her iPad. And other than that, you know, it, we've just seen a lot of um, improvement here and there. So um, we continue to keep her on a gluten-free, dairy-free dairy diet. Um, we give her inulin, um, you know, with her cereal in the morning to help with digestion digestive issues and then we also continue to give her like uh, omega-3 oils for children and so um, you know I don't know if that's helped 
I don't know if that's contributing to some of the new things that we're seeing out of her, but we're going to continue with it. Um, because at this point, you know, um, you know, giving her a healthier gut and helping her with, uh, brain power, I don't see anything wrong with that at the end of the day. Um, there is the, uh, the autism walk that's coming up here locally. And so we, um, in Tampa Bay, and so we are, um, participating in that just to show support so that'll be exciting I have a couple of friends who will be uh, joining our team and just walking with us and um, so that that's really exciting um, to see that the support we've gotten from our friend, friends and family and, and thank you all again for just supporting us so other than that like I said we've um, just been really busy just trying to get her scheduled with everything that's going on and um you know i promise to hop back on here sooner rather than later now that we have her aba therapies locked down and i'll update you and let you know how that goes but other than that just thank you all for the support and um, we'll check back in later